Uh, so I love teaching art just for all the different things that you can do within it. So you can draw, paint, sculpt, make things out of clay, um, come up with architectural models and designs, think about fashion and products and things like that, all different things. Um, and it's, for me, it's seeing where a student's journey will take them and that's as exciting for me as teaching uh, the knowledge that I've got. I studied art because I really enjoy being creative and, you know, I wanted the community quite a lot you know, like, to make friends within art. It's such a great subject, because everyone there really loves doing something that's so different from anything else that they do, and it was really great to see all the trips and opportunities that the school offers in the art curriculum. So at first, we, uh, we run a workshop. So our workshops are in fine art skills, like drawing and painting, and kind of classical art skills. But then we do ceramics workshops, we do textiles workshops, we'll do 3D. Uh, making workshops. We'll do workshops on how to research and develop ideas um, and we'll come up with ideas about composition and then we'll push you to improve the scale and the complexity of your work and we'll do that all the way through the two years so that by the end of the course the work you look at will be really really impressive. Art links in with other subjects a lot because it's, the, it's that creative aspect of like bringing what you enjoy to the subject like for English when we do our coursework it's quite similar in that you're coming up with ideas yourself and being quite inventive. So students are assessed through two projects. Uh, the first project is a project where they choose the theme uh, in consultation with us and that's the project that they can really take in the direction of their interests. So if they're particularly keen on studying architecture, they could do an architectural project. Um, if they love painting, they can explore the painting. So it's really, that's a very open project. Now, that's 60% of the mark. It's all practical. They'll make a sketchbook, they'll do study sheets, they'll make a series of outcomes. Um, and then the second component, which is worth 40% of the mark, is an exam project. Now, that might sound scary, but an exam in art is a practical exam. You're in an art room making artwork, so it'll probably be the best exam that you'll ever do in your life. Um, so, yeah, that's an exam paper, so they'll have six or seven themes to choose from. We choose one of those themes and make a project around that. Yeah, the staff are really great. Like, like we said, they're, they're great, um, great knowledge of artists and stuff like that. And talking you through it and the, the technical help as well is really good. Stuff like the kiln and helping you with any materials that you need is great. Everyone here is so willing to come and help you and help you figure out what you want to be doing with uh, with your project or just with your post 18 in life in general. So the uh, the art exhibition is something we do every year and it's the thing it's the culmination of that two years of work so um, it's the thing that you're aiming for it's a fantastic evening where you can invite your family and friends to come and celebrate that amazing work that you've produced. Um, it's also for us to mark that work and decide where we think it sits with everybody else so there is a real purpose to that. It's it's a really great opportunity as a year 12 to go and visit that and see how people have shown their progress and how they've developed like say from not being too confident or great at a, like portraiture for example and there's some students who have like moved on throughout the year 13 and practiced it and it's absolutely incredible to go and see. Uh, it's really nice seeing the older students um, develop um, their work and it becomes so much more uh, meaningful to them uh, so much more independent in the way that they work and so much more mature through the work that they make. Um, so they, they, they grow as people, not just as artists, I think, across the two years. Uh, and that's a real pleasure to be involved in. I'm hoping in the future, after, after sixth form, to go on and spend a year doing an art foundation. Um, I think everyone I've talked to really recommends that and then go on to university and possibly study architecture.